Francisco. Something special happened in Washington this weekend that had nothing to do with Watergate, the energy shortage, oil embargoes, or economics. Bruce Morton reports. The Washington Monument has turned into the biggest sundial in the world, thanks to a 31-year-old Yugoslavian immigrant named Yuri Schwebler. Schwebler works as a newspaper layout editor, but what he is is an artist with an eye for the unusual, not just the shape, but the shadow. He got permission for his sundial in the snow three years ago and waited for the right combination of sun and snow and waited. The snow came last Friday. Saturday, Schwebler, a friend, and two helpers with a snowplow from the National Park Service went to work, surveying, raying their straight lines out across the snow to clock the shadow. Uh, well, as an artist, one of the things that uh, I do, and I think most artists do, traditionally have done, is point out things people don't see. And I wonder, one day I realized I'd never seen the shadow of the Washington Monument because it's so huge. And then I looked for it and I saw it and it moved. And out at the end uh, of the shadow, it moves about four feet uh, every minute. You know, so it's, you can actually see the earth move or feel it move by watching that shadow. It just goes right, right along. The project costs Schwebler just $24. The rest of the city has had fun worth much more than that, watching the monument shadow till the hour. Quick, Walter, what time is it out there? Time, Bruce, for a commercial.